Can you use a USB flash drive with an iPhone or an iPad? In this video, you're gonna find out. Let's go. So let's cut right to the chase. The answer right now is generally no, but there are a few additional things that you need to know, which we're gonna jump into right now. The first thing you need to know is that right now in July, 2019, there is no USB drive support in iOS 12, which is the current iOS on your iPhone or your iPad. However, Apple have just announced that in iOS 13 and iPad OS, there is going to be support. Meaning if you have a lightning to USB adapter, you're gonna be able to plug in your USB flash drives and then access and transfer files. Yes, it's finally here. So that is a very cool thing. And it means that devices like this, the Lightning to USB 3 adapter, are going to become essential pieces of kit for your iPhone or iPad. In fact, if you're in the future, there'll be a link right there, which will take you to another video showing you how this file integration actually works. When will this all be happening? Well, the rumor is it'll be around September of 2019. That's when iOS 13 and iPad OS will be released, usually at the same time as new Apple devices. So that is when your Lightning to USB adapter is really going to start becoming super valuable. So what do you need to do to prepare? Well, my recommendation is to pick up a Lightning to USB 3 adapter. Now, these are the genuine Apple adapters, and I know you can pick up the aftermarket ones for $5, $10 on eBay. Your mileage is gonna vary with those. And the unfortunate thing is that whenever Apple update their OS, they tend to disable a lot of the cheaper, non-genuine products. So yes, whilst this is about a $30 US device, it is going to be working with all all the future updates of iOS, which means you can use it with iPad OS, iOS 13, and you're gonna be able to use it to transfer your files, plus do a whole bunch of other things as well. For instance, you can connect a USB audio interface and plug in your guitars and your microphones to record on your iPhone or your iPad. Or if you're looking for a simpler solution, how about a USB microphone, a really quick and convenient way to get good quality audio into your iOS device. Or maybe you want something as simple as your typing keyboard to be able to use your keyboard shortcuts and type on your iPad. And you can even use a device like this, a powered USB hub to connect multiple USB devices to your iPhone or your iPad iPad at the same time. And all of the products that I've mentioned in this video are linked in the description and over at studiolivetoday.com slash gear. But what if you can't wait until September? Well, SanDisk make a couple of cool products. They make this one, the iExpand, which actually has a lightning adapter, meaning that you can actually connect it to the lightning port of your iPhone or your iPad. And they also make this one, which is the SanDisk Connect, which actually acts as a Wi-Fi hotspot that you can connect multiple devices to at the same time and share your files. So that's another very cool option if you want to share files in iOS. So I hope this helped answer your question about USB flash drives in iOS. There are two more videos down there with a heap more information that you can check out. You can subscribe to the channel by clicking or tapping on the Studio Live Today icon in the top right corner and I'll see you on the next video.